Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas, I'm your host, and I'm here with TNT Dynamite, the explosive one. I'm the man on the sticks. You are, you have them. And uh, we're playing Madden 20. The 20th way more edition. Yeah, the four to nine a night. Yeah, as always, playing offense only, sim in the D. You're playing on pro. Yes. Because you're a professional. I'm, I'm, we're we're taking an extra step to make sure that these videos are not as effed as the, last, the first week, <laughs> the it's inaugural always, week. It's always the ones that you want to get people hooked on. Yo, it was kind of convenient that the one that came out on Friday the 13th was completely and utterly cursed. Dude, I put it out anyway. Yeah, if it, nobody watches. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. Nobody's gonna win cursed! Arabic the entire thing. Fun fact, Jonas, if you play uh, that curse, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm yeah. telling you right now, that whole curse was sad. Yeah, well, things happen sometimes. We're doing a better job of vetting now. Not yeah. Letting into <laughs> the thing didn't do anything until after the video's done, and they're like, up oh, and then what? Yeah, well, we, we've already went. <laughs> we can't go back in time. Oh, there you. Was he dead? <laughs> <laughs> They're clapping. He just, They're clapping. He's motionless. <laughs> he's he's old. It's fine. <laughs> the way his body is. Are you Russian? Uh, no, dude. Well, that you know, I guess. Dude, I avoid pain like the. Really? Yeah. I think I had one once, but I think it'll get checked out. That's was, usually how it goes down. I was too. young. Mm -hmm. and I was stupid. And my parents were there, and my mom was just like, "Don't go to sleep," because like, you're not supposed to go to Don't sleep go after, to after you sleep. hit your head. Like Freddy's. <laughs> gonna, yes. Exactly. She's like, Freddy's going to get you. <laughs> I was like, oh my God. I knew Freddy wasn't at that point, but I was young. <laughs> um, Yeah, dude. It was, it, I don't know. It felt okay. I didn't feel weird. I was young, but I was always messed up anyway. No, I've never had a concussion, Sarah. You know, I've, I've never gotten to East, well, East sports, extreme sports or anything. Yeah. Uh, I ollie a couple of times on a skateboard. I always thought skateboarding was super cool. But, yeah, yeah. You know, Tony Hawk totally effed up everybody's perception of what skateboarding really was. I don't even know what play I picked. Why's that? Because, man, you're like, yeah, dude, I can, you can do an ollie. Ollies are hard, dude. Oh, just because he was so good. Yeah. I got you. Yeah, he's, yeah. All you got to do is just tap the A button on your body, dude, and you can. Yeah, you just kick your leg a little bit and kick, tap it. Kick, flip, and grind the rail for uh, 20 minutes. Yeah, dude. I'm going to do a cray stare off a hood of a car. <laughs> I remember when Benjamin had, he was playing that game, uh -huh. and he, he had a streak that was like in the millions and he would just keep going yeah we used to do this stuff. i'm sitting there and tricking i was like can you ride a skateboard in real life absolutely not yeah dude, it's like guitar hero players i can play it on hardcore can you play a core no no <laughs> like there's people i know that's playing guitar hero all those songs true. it is it so is, true there. tony hawk tony hawk was like my jam for a really long time we used to sit around <laughs> and just play that see if we get the biggest combos yeah, and, and I used to be pretty good at that game, dude. But yeah, I knew what a I knew what a Bob Burnquist air was. And I knew, <laughs> Bob Burnquist. I know how to do a Christ yeah, air. Yeah, dude, uh, Bucky Lasik. Bucky. Yeah, dude, it was it was a it was a it was a very good game at the time. Like it it is very down downgraded as time has went on, because the last one they put out was complete and utter garbage. Uh, yeah, they did. I'm going to I'm gonna go they for it, Jonas, because I don't care. To, like, it, it reminded me of Madden, because when it first came out, it was good. There was a lot to it, but it was fairly simple. Then they started adding, every year they started adding new stuff. And it got to the point where there was, like, too much. Yeah. Like, going on in it. Because it, it can stop being, like, an arcade just, like, press A to jump in different directions. And it became, into like, you have to control the board. Yeah, and you have and to keep you, it balancing, like as you manual from because you could like do a like grind that. and do another grind. And, <laughs> oh yeah, and yeah, that would yeah. be super. And the more you did it, but it was because you had to keep doing different tricks to get the high multipliers. So if you kept yeah. the same trick, like yeah. you could do up square, down and square, left and square, right and square, left right square, up down, up up, and like you do the specials, dude. It was great. It's it's funny because it's like when you add more to the game and it's less approachable, then it's not as fun for everybody. Right, exactly. Yeah, I feel you 100%. Because you could be bad and still be successful at that game, but it came to a certain point where you just had to learn everything. Right, that and goes it's too much. 
It's like, in the, stuff like that makes people not want to do it. Like, what the F was that? <laughs> oh, no. You were running, you just somersaulted. <laughs> you did a tumble, dude. Yeah, dude, it's uh, it's like Madden, too. Madden is, like, yeah. I've been playing it forever. I see, the, I'm seeing that myself here. And there's just so much to it. On top of having to know what print, da 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 like, situational things, the different controls you can do. It's like, yeah, it's pretty crazy. But, uh, yeah, I love Tony Hawk, dude, so much. God, it, was, it, it was a good game. Yeah, I've always loved skateboarding, but just because I like watching people do it, not because I know I can know even want do you, to try. But, yeah, but do you watch the X Games at all? I used to. I don't need... If I, if I like... I don't watch much of anything anymore, to be honest. Yeah. Um, but if if I was like flipping through the channels and flip through ESPN and there was skateboarding on, nine times out of ten I would stop and watch it. Or snowboarding or anything. I love that stuff. I like I love watching it. It's just You're so not wrong. interesting. It, it, it's it's cool, man. To think that people practice enough to get to that point is right. it's pretty cool. Like that you go down like you're wearing skis and you like go off a jump that's like fifty feet in the air and you're doing that flips. Is crazy. Like, want to do that but i will watch you do it all day or like the guys who will go off those six in the air and then they just <laughs> land on their feet and they're fine they're cool and they just sound yeah. and nitro still do the nitro circus thing where they do bmx they have those giant wooden ramps and they do like bmx and wheelchairs and also like, yeah. guy, like guys in a wheelchair straps himself in does like flips and stuff dude, dude it's just mad respect terrifying to me oh yeah like i would want to try it but i love watching it it's just it's just crazy I mean, I guess it's like, I mean, I guess that's why they like, they make money and stuff. Because it's like, they, it's impressive to watch. Yeah, yeah. And, uh, you know, big ups to anybody who dedicates their life to that. But I don't want to break a bone. And yeah, dude. I don't that like... seems to be something that's pretty inherent. With oh, that. absolutely. And then they're all just like, oh, it's squirrely, dude. I'll be back in a month. I'm like, you broke your back. <laughs> He's like, I can't wait to get back on the bike, dog. No, dude. You absolutely need to stay off the bike. Yeah, he's like, no, dog, I'm good. Like, <laughs> it's a different mentality, man. They're just like, oh, I just shattered my shin. That's cool, dude. Six weeks, I'll be back. And, it, and that's like that. Uh, see, I watch like ridiculousness, and I, I'm just like, yeah, I can't do that ever. <laughs> but uh, it's it's like those that thrill seeker personality. Like that guy's like, dude, I just want to climb that mountain right there. I'm just gonna, I just want to get to the top of that mountain. Like, dude, for why? <laughs> for why? Four K, sir. For me, for why you want to get to the top of this mountain? <laughs> Just the same and I'll thing. tell you for why it's a bad idea. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. Like, what? What did you prove? So you have a story to tell? Is that what it is? Because that's yeah, not man. worth it. I can tell a story that I thought about climbing. It. Just lie. Just lie. <laughs> oh, that's not a white lie, dude. That's just a lie. So what? Wow. At least you're safe. <laughs> just lie. Tell people you hell you climb the mountain. But why? For why on that? Apparently, if it's the most important thing too, you just lie then. <laughs> or do it. I guess. Did I just? Oh, it was the end of the. Oh, yeah, it was okay. The end of the half. I think you missed an opportunity. Yeah, it's, it's okay. fine, dude. You're winning. Opportunity though. this. Yeah, dude, all opportunity something. Yeah. I mean, it's a uh... Jonas. Look, you were talking about you wanted to go skydiving. I've got the perfect way for you to go skydiving and not risk a single hair on that pretty head of yours. Oh, it is pretty. Just lie. Just tell Just lie people. And tell people I did. Tell people you, I'll know. back you up, fam. I got you. You're like, oh, I saw him do it. <laughs> <laughs> the video's around here somewhere. Oh, yeah. we can't find it. I think I, I think I deleted it. <laughs> is that like is that like part of like it's like guy code where you're just like your friends like back you up regardless of what you're saying? I think so. Yeah. You're just like, Yo, oh, nah, honey, I was at the bar all night. Yeah, I was there with him. I saw yeah, him. Yeah, man, man, I was there. Then I'll tell you wrong later in yeah. private. <laughs> Not in mixed company. Am I going to tell you that you, you did the wrong that, thing? Uh, there was a movie a long time ago. It was called A Guy Thing. And yeah. uh, it was like, it was it had a Brody from Mallrats in it. And at one point, uh, this, his girlfriend found panties, somebody else's panties or something. Ooh, that's a bad and day. I don't remember how what, exactly what it was, but... He was like, "Yeah, I got him at the at the the underwear bin in the whatever store or something. Bin. I don't know something about like there being an underwear bin." And she's like, "I'm gonna call the store and ask." And like she calls the store, and some guy answers the phone. He's like, "She's like, I found these underwear at my boyfriend's, and he said that he found them in the underwear bin." And the guy was just like, "Oh yeah, man, we have a wonderful underwear bin." It's da -da 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 -da. <laughs> and then he like and she like hangs up the phone, <laughs> and she was like. 
Oh my god, he said, and then it showed the guy in the store again, and he, the guy was like, what the hell were you talking about? And he was just like, I don't know what the guy think. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> Yo, that's great. That's the way, that's the way the world should know. Stop it, Jonas. We're being, that's toxic masculinity, <laughs> that Jonas. Is, yeah. That is toxic. <laughs> He oh, just random guy answers the phone, girl pissed. Man, we have a wonderful one. We've been here. See, John, that's when we start. Because <laughs> that is toxic masculinity. That yeah, is it's awful. It's like 1950s. <laughs> yes, I was banging my, somebody else's wife and <laughs> wow. lied about it. And <laughs> Straight there. <laughs> Yeah, after feelings and yeah, sanctity. Of the, he was with me all day. He vouched me up. <laughs> after sanctity of a marriage. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, it's awful. But uh, <laughs> it is funny, but it's it is awful. <laughs> How about you just, if you if you want to stay for the rest of your life, just be monogamous, Jonas. Yeah, if you want to be with a woman for the rest of your life, be monogamous with her? Yeah. You tell me how that works out for you. Yeah, dude. Uh, you just find someone. Uh, just find someone to be your everything. We've talked about this. <laughs> this is always what I'm looking for. Yeah. Someone to be your everything. Oh, that's sweet. That's, I mean, that's my goal in life. I don't want to be my own everything. I'm trying to think if I've ever lied to a female. Ever? <laughs> I know for a fact you have. What are you talking about, man? I do. I know a few things. <laughs> I'm trying to figure if I've ever lied to a woman ever. <laughs> Jonas, have you? Have you lied to your mom about something? Bitch. There you go. Boom. Stop <laughs> it. You have to lie to your mom. <laughs> I can't tell her the truth. Are you kidding me? She'll be mad. <laughs> It's the same reason why you lie to your girlfriend. <laughs> She'll be mad. <laughs> like I said, but this, this, this we were talking about this at the end of one video. We were talking about the white lies yeah. are like to protect them, but a real lie is to protect yourself. Kind of, yeah. I guess that's, I, I don't think we said that in the video, but that is kind of a way to like, because a white lie, like it like, it like gets the truth <laughs> a little so bit awful. to protect somebody. Yeah. And a in a lie lie is like you're you're trying to like protect yourself from getting caught about something. Omission is kind of a lie as well though. Absolutely is. Oh, that was What the hell happened there? It shot out of you like a gun. He had in his midst. Alright, I'm going back to iForm, dude. This is what I this is what I get for not just staying in my form. iForm's one of my favorites. It's my most used. Oh, got it. Sure yeah, did. man. Uh, so, have you ever lied to a woman? <laughs> yeah, I asked you. Of course, you already <laughs> called me out on it. I mean, everyone has, dude. I don't want to hear everyone has. I, like, I want to okay, hear yes. Have I lied? <laughs> like, have I lied to protect myself? Absolutely. Yes. Okay, 100%, Jonas. We're all human, man. You're going to lie. I try to be a good person, man, but I can't be a good... You juked him, and I was impressed. <laughs> that was a user juke. He was an ex-boy. He was lit up with his ex-power, and you freaking juked him like a bee. <laughs> if there's one thing I could do, Jonas, I like to on an open field. I will watch. Watch it. Well, here it comes here. Oh, he oh, looked like a bee. You <laughs> broke his keys, dude. Yeah, man. I think we all have. We've all done that. All right. Not that we're condoning lying and there nope. is no difference between a white lie and there isn't i felt bad about it. what lies are bad i felt bad about lying if you love somebody you tell them the truth i guess the i guess the other thing is if you lie to people and you don't give a crap that's a lot worse than if you like lie and feel it that is true because <laughs> if not true. you're just a sociopath and don't that, care yeah yeah that makes you a bad man yeah dude sometimes protecting others makes you hurt yourself yeah, so I don't know, John. I don't know if I do anything intentionally to hurt people. No, I try my best not. To. I'm pretty sure that that's that's indicative of a sociopath. That's my uh, my mantra is to try to not. My my mantra is to try to build people up, not break people down. Amen. In general, friends, lovers, relationship partners, coworkers. <laughs> what do you mean relationship partners? Well, I mean, a, that? A, 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 lover, a lover can be different than your like relationship partner. Jones, like, relationship you rocking like lovers, bro, fam? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> why you got lovers in ish? And why did you plural lovers? <laughs> you little whore. <laughs> <laughs> Who the 
hell says that? <laughs> I'm speaking euphematically. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, I'm not speaking of like. It, oh, I thought you were saying that you had all these lovers. No, you. no, no. I was I like, mean, dang. <laughs> Lovers. <laughs> That's people you're banging. Make sure you don't have a baby with any of your lovers. <laughs> Do fight. I want to have a baby? <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, yo, I, I don't think I told you this. Okay. But uh, when I was leaving, when I quit my job, uh-huh. and I was leaving, somebody... <laughs> Uh, one of the one of my coworkers beckons me over to her car window, and this is yeah. a this is a oh is it time out? Okay, I do got enough time. It was uh she's a homosexual a, a lesbian woman. Okay, um and she says, you know what? You've always been really cool. I was wondering if by any chance you would be willing to fumble. If you want the fumble? Would you be ruining? <laughs> She was like, I was wondering if you'd take, if you would give me some, some, uh, Seed? some semen. And I was like, yo, I was like, I'd love to, I will 100% do it, but I got fixed a few years ago. So I'm shooting blanks and, uh, heartbroken. She actually, she was cool with it. I was like, look, I would, but like for real, I was like, I would, I was Dang. wondering, did you do that? Dude, that would be like. Like, okay. It, depending who it was, I would consider it strong. <laughs> depending on who it was? I would, I would consider it. Okay. I mean, obviously. You so you feel to, like you wouldn't just do it to anybody? No. Um, but you need, I mean, because, like, essentially, I mean, that's still your, I mean, it's still, like, your yeah. genetics in that kid. Yeah, but, you know. It's like, and obviously there'd be, like, some contractual things you'd have to, like, write up and things to, so they don't come back for you later to try to, you know what I mean? Like, um... It would be. That's that's. I would like. I would be so flattered, dude. <laughs> you would be flattered. I would be immensely flattered if, like, a lesbian came to me and was like, "I want to have a baby." Yeah. But I, and I think you're a good a enough baby. dude that I would take your seed to have your baby. Yeah, and she definitely and she definitely did that. And I, you know, I was I was flattered. Yeah, right. To say like, the least. Um, stroke your ego a little bit. And I, I definitely would have helped her out too, because I feel like even though she's hood as hell, everybody deserves a child. And you know, go ahead, dude. I got, I got decent. Imagine someone coming to me and asking me that. I would tell her the truth. Like, look, I got, I got like asthma, and uh, of course, there's the whole, you know, jail time I did for murdering that one guy. Yeah, it's cool. There's some tendencies, but it's alright. <laughs> Wasn't my fault though, dude. Yeah, he, right. He was asking for he, it. He asked to get murdered. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude, that would be, whoo, man, that's interesting. Oh, there's the win. We did it. Oh man. Oh, well, well, I guess I'll just go home and shoot myself in the face. Wow, don't talk like that. That's angry. <laughs> yeah, really dark at the end of this video. <laughs> Not really? We talked about me Baby wanting to help lesbians. Yeah, dude. Cool, man. I don't even know how we got there. Uh, I don't. Who knows? I don't know. All right, that's all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed the content you saw today. Uh, share it, send it to grandma, bow it up, watch the videos, put on playlists, and just let it run all day. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) For Jonas. Watch all the commercials in TNT Dynamite. Catch you later. We. Oh. Oh.